In your experience in, in Italy, are there other adjunctive therapies that are being used to support the immune system nutritionally or through supplements that are making a difference? Well, supplements to me are uh, in, uh, in, an incredible tool. And um, I think that uh, using um, uh, supplements is so important, especially in the, in the, in the preliminary uh, preventing approach, which is, um, which is uh, important. And adding to zinc and vitamin D, I believe very much in quercetin in uh, in uh, lactoferrin which is uh, two uh, two molecules that are very effective in 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 helping to prevent the infection from ozone from uh, mm -hmm. sorry from the covid and um, what i also use in my practice i don't know if it's it's a general uh, practice in italy but i can tell you my experience i use a lot also um uh, 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 medical mushrooms such as uh, mm. um uh, Ganoderma and uh, and uh, Cordyceps. They're two mm. that are immune active, and I see together with these uh, elements we we just talked about are very effective, and and they are so much uh, helpful in in you know defeating rather than preventing the infection of uh, of uh, of COVID. Uh, together with also um, probiotics. That actually, the one we used actually in the protocol we we, we published and we did for ozone, we also added on the use of um, Bifidobacterium, um, uh, 450 million uh, of those every every day, twice a day, because the bacteria itself um, sort of uh, killed the virus. It's a direct um, sort of interaction, negative interaction yeah. to the virus. So these are things that I, I believe very much work and, and they can help, especially patients that are not in, uh, so critical, but, you know. That's right. Effective. I mean, we, we're really not talking about a sort of widespread public health message that incorporates the science of how to boost your immune function through food or through nutraceuticals. <laughs>